Hi, welcome to Introduction to Golem Crowd, updated for Golem version 6. My name's Gareth Stevenson, and I'll be taking you through this user-friendly crowd simulation tool for Maya. Golem has some powerful features that give you the ability to quickly create natural looking crowds, and is used in production by many studios around the world. This is their 2017 showreel, showing some of that work. The first version of this course was recorded in 2014 for Golem version 3. A lot has changed since then, so we decided to bring it up to date, completely re-recording in Golem 6. We'll cover the same areas as before through the updated interface and take a look at some major new features like the layout tool and the cache library. We'll look at each stage of the process in detail, taking our original Maya assets, a character skeleton, animation, skin geometry and materials, and converting them for use in the crowd system. You'll learn some techniques for getting greater visual diversity from your assets and editing your animations inside Gollum. We'll look at how we can use bipeds as well as a more unusual custom character setup. We'll explore the range of techniques we can use to easily place characters throughout an environment before spending several lessons with the behavior editor where we'll look at a range of character behaviors including character locomotion and physics, set triggers and have characters react to events in the scene. After setting up the crowds, we'll cover the simulation and rendering process, ending the course highlighting some useful tips picked up during production. While this is an introduction class and you'll be able to follow along if you're new to Gollum, we'll go into detail and cover a wide range of information, so even an experienced user should pick up some new tricks. Hope to see you in class one.